Another example, multiply the two matrices. The first has two rows and two columns. So, it's, so the first is two by two. The second has two rows and three columns. So it's two by three matrix. Check, make sure that the two inside numbers are the same. The order of the new matrix is two by three. So we expect two rows and three columns. Start by the first row here and the first column here to get the first element in the new matrix. So take the first here times the first here plus the second here times the second here and so on. So two times one to be two and minus three times two to be six. So two minus six to be negative four. To find the second element in the first row, we are in the first row of the first matrix and go to the second column of the second matrix. Take the first here times the first here, then plus the second here times the second here. 2 times 0 to be 0 and negative 3 times 1 to be negative 3 so it's negative 3 to find the third element in the first row we are still in the first row the first matrix and go to the third column in the second matrix so 2 times 3 the first times the first 2 times 3 to be 6 and plus negative 3 times 0 to be 0 2 so it's 6 now the second row in the new matrix, go to the second row in the first matrix and start by the first column of the second matrix. So 4 times 1 to be 4 plus 5 times 2 to be 10. So 4 and 10 to be 14. So it's 14. Now the second element, so the second column in the second matrix with the second, with the second row in the first matrix. So 4 times 0 to be 0. And 5 times 1 to be 5. So it's 5. The second row of the first matrix with, with the third column in the second matrix. So 4 times 3 to be 12. And 5 times 0 to be 0. So it's 12. The order of the new matrix is 2 by 3. Or the two outside numbers. So 2 by 3. Another example. Multiply the two matrices. The first has one row. And three columns so it's one by three matrix the second has three rows and one column so it's three by one matrix check that the two inside numbers are the same the order of the new matrix is one by one so the new matrix has only one element it's one by one take the first row with the first column so 4 times 5 to be 20 and plus 2 times negative 6 to be negative 12 and plus negative 1 times 8 to be negative 8 five. add all of this you get 0 it has only one row and only one column 